west, out west, out west, out west, out west, out west, out west. <laughs> What's up, Sunseeds? What's up? This your girl, Mystic Sunflower. I'm back to give you guys a collective general energy reading. It doesn't matter what your sign is, Sunseeds, for this message to resonate. Just please make sure you're using discernment. Take what resonate and leave the rest behind. Okay? Let's tap in. Let's tap in for you guys. Let's see what's going on. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Divine, my ancestors of the highest bright light, my spirit guides, my holy angels, Archangel Michael, please protect me while I channel the energy for the collective sun seeds. Anything other than highest bright light, please close shut and block that door. Please and thank you. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit. What are the messages you want the collective sun seeds to hear? So someone is saying, I know you were sent from heaven to show me true love. Somebody feels like you're the whole package, okay? Everything that they was looking for in a woman and a man, you just that. A relationship could have been one-sided. <clears throat> Somebody could be now realizing that, that they had the whole package. It says, I know you were sent from heaven to show me true love. This person could have gave you mixed emotions, sun seeds. They said, when I think of when I think of the times we shared, I miss you so much. What can I do to make it right? So this person wants to know what can they do to make um, things right between you guys. Okay. When this person thinks of the times you guys um this person spends a lot of time thinking about the time that you guys share and it's actually making them miss you even more and more. Um, this is someone who hid their emotions for you, from you. Yeah. And because of that, they gave you guys mixed emotions. You weren't really, you wasn't really sure how this person felt about you. This was somebody who uh, was wearing a mask. They were hiding their feelings and their emotions. It could have stressed you out or, you know, um, bothered you a lot trying to figure out, you know, um, how this person truly felt. You know, one minute you felt like you guys was on good terms, everything was on the up the up, and then the next minute, you wasn't sure. Okay, we have Violet, and there was a third party. For some of you guys, this person was definitely very abusive to you. Um... I hope not physically, but, um, you know, emotionally. For some of you guys, this person was just a spiritual bully to you guys. Um, but there was definitely a third party here. Yeah, that's why I said earlier that really, this, took, this was definitely one-sided. <clears throat> yeah, somebody hooked up with a rebound. So they could have hooked up with this person after you decided to pull your energy back, Sunseeds. Somebody could have been trying to run for, run for the, run from the the feelings how they felt about you, um, hope with the hopes of you know getting getting up with a rebound, um, that they'll forget about you, but that didn't work at all. Okay, they said I know you were stiff from having to show me true love. Um, to be honest with you, also to pick it up with this violent card, um, this third party could have been very aggressive to this person. This third party could have uh, treated them like, like, basically like shit. You were someone who was treated them good. And they hid their emotions from you. That's why they think about all the times that you guys share and miss you. Because ain't nobody missing nobody. Ain't nobody missing nobody that literally was violent towards them, hurt them, beat them up, made them feel the type of way. This person is missing you because they know you were sent from heaven to show them true love. They know your love was pure. Somebody actually hooked up with a, a rebound that was violent as heck, okay? Someone who was mean, okay? Someone who treated them the same way they treated you. I heard painful thoughts. <clears throat> Give me one Holy Spirit. I'm getting ready to come towards you. So this person is thinking about heading towards you, yeah, because uh, 
this person is hanging on to you okay it's somebody who's single okay seeing things from a new perspective yeah your love was very genuine and they see that they see that now okay after going through a painful experience um with a rebound um that was nothing like you nothing like you it has this person full of regret yeah somebody has so much pain a lot of you guys is your twin flame yeah uh, friendship seekers and deception this could have been a friend of theirs they could have told you someone was just a friend but they actually wound up hooking up with them and it became a rebound yeah yeah we have forever and feelings in reverse this gives me the energy of someone telling you, you know, I love you, you know, I want to be with you, I want to marry you, I want to live with you, um, I want, you know, all of these beautiful things, you know, with you. And then the next minute, you know, you don't hear from this person, you know, they come more very emotionless with the feelings in reverse, you know, you don't hear from them. It's like, you know, you, you just told me all of these um, beautiful, um, I heard beautiful lies. Wow. Yeah, they was wearing a mask. Okay. They was wearing a mask. For some of you guys, you have recovered from this relationship. You have healed from this relationship. You're getting out more. Maybe spending time with friends at the beach. Just chilling, living your life. Somebody could be knowing that. Um, maybe it's this person is looking at your pictures. Okay, someone is getting jealous because they're missing you. Yeah, they're missing you. This person is getting karma for how they treated you. Give me more on this energy, Holy Spirit. This person is saying that they love you. Yeah, they regret not showing this. They regret giving you mixed emotions. They, re they regret hiding this from you. Yeah, this person finds you incredibly attractive. Yeah, you was loyal. You. you was loyal you to this person. Very much loyal. You. Uh, something can be um, significant about the um, the winter time because I'm looking at all of this snow. Yeah, this person could have been very vindictive power hungry one-sided relationship some of you guys this person was very very uh, much controlling it's like someone they wanted to control you um you know get you to listen to them while they go out and you know do whatever they want to do i also heard earlier this person was a spiritual bully somebody felt like they owned you okay or you you know <clears throat> they could just hide their feelings and treat you any type of way yeah, but I, I feel like you put your foot down and said, heck no. Yeah. And they got with a rebound that was very mean to them. Yeah. This person was very dishonest to you, Sunsees. They were. And I feel like they met someone, you know, just someone to match their energy. <laughs> yeah, sure did. And it fell out right on third party. I can't make it up. They met a shady behind energy. Very shady. There was a third party in shady. Yeah. This rebound was just as shady, um, deceptive, just as they were. They met, they match, and they regret it. Mm-hmm. And somebody feels like you living your best life. You living your best life. Yeah. All this person have right now is the memories that you guys share. And I feel like, it, honestly, it makes this person, it, it, it hurts this person. I, I just feel like they had a lot of pain because your love was genuine. You was loyal, you know? They hit back these emotions. They didn't want you to actually know how much they truly, truly cared about you. How much they was into you. We have a twin flame feminine. So divine feminine, this can definitely be your... Um, 
you know, your twin flame, the ones who um, resonate with twin flame, that's on a twin flame journey. Yeah, this person watched you from a distance. I feel like somebody's watching you celebrate, live your best life. They could be watching you, or you know, watching your house, watching you around where you live, or this could just be social media. For others of you guys, I feel like this person is watching you energetically. I feel like somebody was a spiritual bully. They was kept trying to invade, um, you know, coming into your energy. They were spying. Yeah, this person is saying they think the world of you. Somebody wants another shot at this connection with you guys. This person gave into temptation with someone who was shady, mean, aggressive, violent towards this person, lazy. Ooh, child, I gave into temptation with lazy. Ooh, they, they did not. <laughs> Ooh, child, son, see. Not, this rebound was lazy, shady, violent, mean. Okay. Ooh. I'm hearing this person learn the harsh lesson. Yeah. After this breakup. They learned the lesson. They learned the lesson. That's why this person is saying they coming towards you. This person is praying for another chance. Give me more Holy Spirit. Yeah, break up. Came back out. This person felt like they weren't good enough for you. Insecure. This person felt like they weren't good enough for you, Divine Feminine. This was somebody who was selfish. This was somebody who was selfish, okay? Because they couldn't control you, okay, and dominate you to, to get you to do, you know, uh, what they wanted you to do. Um, you put your energy back. You're not gonna allow, you're not gonna allow someone to treat you any type of way to benefit them for their own pleasure. Giving you mixed emotions, hiding a um, hiding a emotion, wearing a forced mask. Mm -mm, this person was, this person was selfish. So you decided, you know, your worth, divine feminine. You pulled your energy back. This person acts as divine for someone like you, but they, but well, when they got it, they made it about them. They made it about them. They were selfish. They didn't. They didn't think one, one time to think about how this is gonna make you feel, or how you how you how you feel about this situation. Is this right? Should I be treating this person like this? No, this person was worried about their needs. This person wanted more in a woman or a man, and divine definitely blessed this person with it. And then when they got it, this person was just very selfish. It's like they wanted more and more and more, only to get less. They got somebody who was shady, who was violent, who was mean, okay? Lazy, didn't want to do anything, expected them to do everything. This person was dishonest to them. And you got loyalty, genuine love, divine feminine, Okay? ready to tell you how I feel about you. This person is ready to open up and tell you how they feel about you. This person feels like you guys um, have a very spiritual connection. Um, if you don't have children by this person, this person definitely wants to have children by you. Um, somebody can be pregnant if so. Congratulations. For others of you guys, um, you're just very fertile at this time. You're birthing new things, your ideas. Um, 
you know, you created a lot of things that you're just bringing into fruition. You're very fertile at this time um, and very dedicated to your spiritual journey. And somebody is wishing that they would, you know, had kids by you somewhere to where they could have, you know, still have a part of you. Because some of you guys are just far gone. You know, you, you just get left. Yeah, this person is stressed. Mm-hmm. There was definitely someone that was interfering in this relationship between you guys. That's why this person gave you unrequited love. And it says there was a third party. Now, this third party could be anybody, a person, place, or thing. Okay? <clears throat> but being that rebound is right next to here, it was definitely someone who they was, um, who they was messing around with. Okay? Yeah, but they discovering you're the abundant one. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I want to make love to you and clarity. They want to come and bring you some type of clarity, confession. Yeah. Mm, this person is saying that y'all story ain't over yet. They say that this third party was just a flame. They gave into temptation. They feel like you guys have a soul connection and decisiveness. Yeah, they was very indecisive. They didn't know what the hell they wanted to do. They didn't know if they want to play the field or or settle down with you. Somebody also feels divine feminine. I just heard mystery. So somebody felt like you are a mystery. So maybe this person got frustrated because they felt like they couldn't read you. You know, they didn't know if this was what they was what they prayed for um, when it actually showed up. They didn't believe that they actually got their blessing. They actually got what they asked for. Ooh, child. Somebody feels like something about you is a mystery. Just heard a mystery. Yeah, paranoia. This person is paranoid, stressed out. Yeah, because they're getting karma. I wrote a song about you. For some of you guys, you can be dealing with someone um, who's a performer who works in the music industry. You can write songs. They can write songs. <clears throat> This person could wear a lot of um, hoodies, you know, jogger pants. Give me more Holy Spirit. That's not going to be for everybody. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody the bomb mask on did. Mm. Yeah, this person could be a performer, write songs, rap. Um, somebody could be a DJ. <clears throat> divine masculine energy, divine masculine energy. Yeah, this person, this person was just not ready. They was not ready uh, to settle down and give, give you the commitment that you deserve. But yet, instead of being honest with you, they led you on. This divine masculine is definitely single and spying. I'm telling you, this person is watching you from afar. Okay. Give me more on single divine masculine. Thank you. Ooh, this person is saying they're going crazy without you, son. Oh, wow. This person gave in to lust. Mm-hmm. And they regret it. Ooh, they regret it. This person missed how it feels being with you. Yeah, Divine Master is going through awakening at this time. Friendship. What's, give me messages on friendship. Messages on friendship. Finances are a problem. So this person could be going through a lot of financial issues at this time. 
Maybe this person spent a lot of time uh, blowing their money, irresponsible with their money, very materialistic, spending uh, money, um, showing off, um, to showing off to a bunch of friends, you know, hanging out, um, being very irresponsible doing, you know, when it comes to their finances, you know, when it comes with their money, they just, they splurge, they do a lot with their friends and start handling their business. Give me more. Yeah, power hungry. This is somebody who wanted to be in control. Even at a distance, they wanted to be controlled. Or you just was not having that divine feminine, divine masculine. What's the um, finances or, or problem? Yeah. This person's on a spiritual journey now. Oh, they definitely going through a wake now. Mm-hmm. And they feel like they can't give you what you need right now because of everything that they going on, everything that's going on in their life around them. But they are coming towards you to bring you some type of clarity. Mm -hmm. They coming towards you to bring you some type of clarity, though, with the hope that you will listen, divine feminine. Yeah, abundance. I watch you from a, a distance. I'm telling you, this person spies and watch you from a distance, Divine Feminine, and they see you in this beautiful, very abundant energy. Yep. They feel like you don't need them. They feel like you don't want for anything. They feel like you're living your best life. Yeah, this person was impatient. This person was impatient. Uh, maybe where you at right now, Divine Feminine, you wasn't always in this uh, place, you know, when you was dealing with, uh, you know, with this person. But this person was impatient. This is somebody who who looks at the outer, you know, and study the end, you know, you know, the um, who a person are, who a person is inside means so much more than what they out, you know, outside look like. And this person was impatient. They wanted the superficial things. They wanted to live their best life with their friends. They wanted to be out celebrating. They wanted to look like they was that when they wasn't really that. And I feel like you spend time working on yourself. And within time and the distance between you guys, you know, you guys glue up. You know, you had a major glow up. You know, divine feminine, your life is different. Um, you know, the divine, you know, shower even, you know, you was already blessed before, but divine shout even more blessings on you when this person decided to do this to you. You know, it's like um, you got rewards for you know for, for all the pain that this person put you through after they you know left and, and did what they did, and now somebody is watching you from a distance, and they're like, "Damn, you so abundant! Like, how was I so impatient? Why did not I just wait?" Mm. No. Nah. I'm hearing you're very smart, you're very intelligent, you don't mess with nobody, you know, you mind your business, okay? You don't do drama. The friends that you do have are very genuine connections. Yeah, somebody wants to apologize. It says the way you carry yourself is so attracted to me. This person is very attracted to me. How you, um, you know, the way you carry yourself. It makes this person want you even more. Everything about you is abundant. And this person is so sorry for the way they treated you. This card don't even belong in this deck. Yeah, decisions. What's the decisions? Decisions. Yeah, secret. I feel like this uh, decisions and secrets. Yeah, they kept secrets from you. Mm-hmm. They kept secrets from you. They decided to go a different, um, go a different way. You know. For some of you guys, um, You know, whatever decision that they made, whatever path they, they have uh, went down before being very deceptive, they regret it. They regret it. 
for others of you guys, because I'm looking at this yellow with this man or woman that's standing in the middle, okay? Yellow speaks of, uh, for me is a solar plexus chakra, you know. Um, I feel like this person is um, is trying to be confident and um, just give them like confident, trying to get the confidence, okay, to choose, you know, which path they want to go, go down. Um, I feel like with the secret card, they're doing it in private. It, it's giving like the hermit mode. You know, somebody is, you know, they know one path is not going to, you know, is, is, is no longer for them. And they know the other path is leading towards you. That's why they want to come towards you. But I feel like there's somebody who's doing it in private. Yeah, the fear. Yeah. They know that they need to make the right decision this time. They know that. And the only thing I feel like with this yellow is that this person is trying to get the confidence up to do that now. You know, in secret, in private. But with the fear and genuine love, this is somebody who prayed for someone like you. And he actually got it. And then they was afraid. It says fear and genuine love. It's like asking the divine for something and then getting it and not appreciating it. You know? Someone literally prayed for someone like you and then got you in their life and then they were scared. Give me more of the decisions. I just feel like somebody trying to get the confidence and the courage up now. <clears throat> you know? Yeah, it says I banned people to make myself feel important. Mm. This person, ooh, that's why they're going through this awakening now. Okay? They abandoned people to make them. This is this was more this. That's what I'm saying. That's why spirit gonna really whoop this person down with that karma we seen earlier. It's because you pray for somebody and then spirit give it give you give you them, and then you like, oh, I want to see if it's better. I want I, I just you know I, you know I and I want to see if there's more out there for me. Or spirit give you someone and then you make it all about you. What about what about what about the, the divine feminine? They were selfish. It was more so about them. It's like playing in the divine face. So they're gonna play in their face. Yeah. It's like, oh, you think you you think you got it down pack. You think, you know, wherever you headed, you think everything gonna be on the up or the up. No, I got a trick for you. Somebody met somebody shady, violent, dishonest. I'm I'm talking about all of it. Okay? This somebody who abandoned people to make themselves feel important. This somebody who's running from something. It's something inside they was running from. But now they have to be ready. The way how this person is standing on top of this mountain, spirit is making this person face whatever whatever fear that's in them that they needed to need to heal. Okay, so they can stop hurting innocent people like you. And they are being they are having to face that. Okay. Yeah. Somebody met someone even better than them, okay? That was just as shady, violent, um, you know, mean, okay? Possibly even abandoned them just like how they abandoned you. They had the whole damn thing. But they was, a, they was afraid of genuine love. That's why spirit is, is going to constantly bless you the way they do. And the way how spirit bless you when this person did this, it's like all this person could do is look at you from afar. They was very manipulative. That's why the first card out, it says, I know you were sent from heaven to show me true love. Give me more Holy Spirit. Yeah, new perspective. That's what it is. They seeing things from a high uh, perspective now. Oh, they enlightened. Yeah, they stressed out. Yeah, fear and obsessive. Th yeah, this person is very, uh, I heard possessive. Obsessive. This per okay, you could be getting with all these phones. You could get a lot of attention. This person doesn't like that you get a lot of attention on this phone. Maybe a lot of people um, watch you on social media, or um, you could be a performer in, in, in the industry. Maybe you putting out a song. But honestly, I like I said, I just feel like um, for some of you guys, you could be on set. You could be an actor or actress. Yeah. 
but I, for others of you, I just feel like you're just getting a lot of attention and this person is afraid. They're afraid. That's why they're coming towards you because they don't want to lose you. They feel like, you know, a lot of eyes on you, a lot of people, you know, you get attention from a lot of people. Yeah, this is somebody who don't want to see you with someone else. This is someone who desires you. They feel like, thank you, they feel like a lot of people are desiring you. They're afraid of that. Judgmental. This person was very judgmental. This person is afraid. Um, this person can be worried that you know you're being intimate with um someone else. Invasion. Yeah, invasion. I feel like this person, somebody. I feel like this person is a spiritual bully. This person tried to invade just your, your, your space energetically. Okay. Something could have been going on for 18 months. Maybe this person rejected you 18 months ago. But this person is getting karma. Or that could be how long they're going to be in spiritual jail. Very vindictive. This person feels like you deserve better than them. Envy. And thinking of you. Somebody envies, whoever this rebound is, I don't feel like this is your person that envies you at all. I feel like whoever this rebound is, they envy the fact that this person thinks about you all the time. I'm also hearing this person feels like you know how to push their buttons. Something about the attention that you're getting. This person feels like you know how to push their buttons. I don't know. Maybe this person wants you to, um, you know, um, this is somebody who doesn't want people to see you. So maybe this person doesn't want you to be on social media. Maybe this person doesn't want you to be, you know, um, being an artist, you know, doing what you love or, or recording um, on set, I'm getting, okay? Maybe you're in a movie. Maybe you're a performer. Or maybe you're just doing something on social media and it's a B. Ooh, I might want to do a big B too. Um, it's like somebody don't want you to get all of this attention, you know? Ooh. And they feel like you know that that pushes their buttons. So it's like somebody wants you to be hidden. It's, that's what I'm saying. It's like somebody still wants to try to control you that's not with you. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, this person needs to do the shadow work. That's why they're going through awakening. I told you, jealous and possessive. I knew what I was feeling. Yeah. Because what I'm picking up on is like, what? Like, I know what? It says, you bright in my world. I love you. Yeah, I know what the heck I'm feeling. It's like, how the hell somebody wants so much control of a person? Like, even if you was with them, they shouldn't be trying to control you like that. Love is not control. Yeah, this, I, I seen the car early. I must have put it back in. Why? It's very insecure. You make this person very insecure. Yeah, you make this person very insecure. Give me more home spirit. Six of Wands. I'm telling you, I can't make it up. What's under the bottom? The death card. Six of Wands. The death and rebirth. Uh, whatever you have gone through, whatever this rebirth was, you get a lot of attention. Six of Wands. Somebody don't want you getting attention from nobody. Yeah, Seven of Cups. They feel like you got options. A lot of people interested in you. A lot of people checking for you. Okay? Six of Pentacles. A lot of people want to give to you. Woo, child. I'm telling you, son. See, I'm telling you. I knew what I was feeling. Yeah, the chariot. <laughs> they run into you now. Okay, we got um, Cancer Scorpio energy. Um, six of Wands. We got, uh, what's that, Leo energy? Yeah, this person is, they coming towards you to bring you some type of clarity. Mm-hmm. Five of Pentacles, four of Cups. Yeah, they want to come out the cold. Mm-hmm. They want to come out the cold. Six of Cups, somebody from your past that reminiscing about you, want to reconcile with you. They want to come out this cold. They bored. They don't like being single. They don't like just, they tired of keep watching you from afar. Somebody wants to come. Yeah, they want to come towards you. Whoever this person, but they in the tower. Spirit said they in the tower. 
Yep, six of cups to the tower. Spirit said they in the tower right now. This is their karma. Yeah, the will of fortune. The will has turned. This is their karma. Ace of swords. Spirit said this is the damn truth. Ace of swords to the star. And look at you. Look at you being a star. Your karma is to be the star. To be, to get a breakthrough. Okay? Triumphant. You know? Your, 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 your karma is to win. And this person is obsessing over you. Give me a card on the chariot. Chariot energy. Ooh. Damn. Justice in reverse. Libra energy. This person's getting karma. What's the tower? The tower is playing foul with the king of swords. They was mean. Okay? They was mean. They didn't show their no emotions. Okay? Barely communicated. And when they did, um, sometimes they come they could have came over, you know, real mean and bitter. They have Knight of Wands in reverse. This person was a player player from the Ooh, yeah. Give me a card on the uh, Ace of Swords. Yeah, they coming towards you telling you everything. <laughs> Ace of Swords of Temperance. Things are being balanced out in your life. After going through, you know, what you was going through. Yeah, Nine of Cups. You're getting all your wishes fulfilled because you deserve it. Mm -mm. Two of Cups, the Hermit. Ten of Swords. Somebody who betrayed you is now. I told you earlier, they ain't Hermit. They, they, they single. And all they want, Two of Cups is somebody who only has eyes for you, who want a relationship with you. Yeah, this person is in Hermit reflecting how they betrayed you, how they treated you. Anything else, Holy Spirit, as I close this out? Look, Ten of Pentacles. This is where you had it. Mm, somebody feel like they messed up their family, you know, or they, um, you know, messed up someone who they were supposed to have a Ten of Pentacles with. <clears throat> they rushing towards you. They see you, Divine Feminine. They, they like, oh, hell no. Abundant Divine Feminine. Clarity. They coming towards you because they want to come out of this tower, you know? And they feel like they, you know, they want to start off by being honest with you, letting you know everything. I love you guys so very much. Anything you know about me will be in the description box on seeds. Until mm, so we get up next time, let's get you guys some signs. We have cancer out here. Give me more. Hope this reading was able to give you guys clarity. You know? We have Virgo. Give me more Holy Spirit. We have Aquarius. We have Aries. Give me more Holy Spirit. Taurus. And we have Capricorn. Okay. Sagittarius and Leo. Okay. Latest on seats.